Government will change the initial architectural design of Agenda 111 hospitals earmarked in some districts. Health Minister Kwekwa Jimamenu, while taking delivery of some medical supplies from the Italian government, noted this decision has become necessary due to lack of land space for the project in densely populated areas. President Kufu Addo, in his 2022 State of the Nations address, in March, assured that government's Agenda 111 hospitals project would be ready before the end of his term, of his second term of office. We have every intention of seeing this project through to its successful end, which will enable me to commission all 111 hospitals before I leave office on 7th January 2025. The health minister, Kwekua Jimanmen, while taking delivery of some medical supplies from the Italian government, reiterated construction work has commenced in some of the districts. He, however, noted there still remain a challenge in acquiring land space for work to commence in some regional capitals. According to the minister, due to this challenge, the initial design of the project will be changed. It's too early for me to predict whether I will finish or not. But optimistically, that is what we want to do. And we try to push ourselves. And we still have challenges to live in land, especially in the big cities like Accra and Kumasi. We are now changing the infrastructure, I mean design. So that instead of spreading across bigger land area, we want to go up. So they are doing designs and looking at soil testing and things in some areas where we have challenges. Even in the communities, the districts, some chiefs are coming you know, and um, there are litigation in some areas. Meanwhile, the health minister is optimistic the medical supplies from the Italian government would go a long way to help government in expanding health infrastructure. The country received electric intensive care beds, multi-parametric monitors, echo tomograph, syringe pumps, among other items meant for ICUs. These beds you see here, are ICU beds, intensive care unit. The equipment we don't have many in our system. And I believe it will go so much very, very far and deep in our intensive care service delivery. You know. The Italian ambassador to Ghana recommends modernization of Ghana's health system. I think that uh, we, we could uh, support Ghana as regards the modernization of the hospitals. Uh, last week I visited, for example, the Richard Novati Catholic Hospital in the Volta region and technicians came from Italy to adjust some of the machineries. The items were brought in by the Italian Navy Rizzo crew who are on a mission with coastal states to combat maritime piracy and fight against illicit trafficking at sea.